Hello good day viewers. In this tutorial, we are going to find a solution to this nice Olympiad mathematics question. We are given that if a is a root of this quadratic equation x squared minus 3x plus 1 equal to 0, where a is not equal to 0, we are asked to evaluate a to the power of 3 divided by a to the power of 6 plus 1. So first of all, you should remember a root of a quadratic equation, when substituted into that quadratic equation, the result will be zero, definitely. So let us substitute a into this equation. So if x is equal to a, we have a to the power of 2 minus 3a plus 1 equal to 0, meaning if x equal to a. So from here, we can divide each term by a since we have seen that a is not equal to 0. If we do that, we have a squared divided by a equal to a minus 3a divided by a is 3. Then plus 1 divided by a equal to 0 divided by a, which is 0. Let us take the constant to the right hand side, leaving a plus 1 divided by a equal to positive 3. Next, I want us to square both sides. We have a plus 1 divided by a all squared equal to 3 squared. To the left hand side, we take the first term, we square that. We take the second term, we square that. Then we add 2 multiplied by the first term multiplied by the second term. If you observe a multiplied by 1 divided by a is 1. So 1 times 2 is still 2. To the right hand side, we have 3 squared equal to 9. Take this one to the right hand side, it becomes negative. a squared plus 1 divided by a squared equal to 9 minus 2. So finally, we have our a squared plus 1 divided by a squared to be equal to 7. Let's give this one aside. Now going back to what we are asked to evaluate, which is this, a cubed divided by a to the power of 6 plus 1. This is that. I would like to divide both numerator and denominator by a to the power of 3. So we have a to the power of 3 divided by a to the power of 3 divided by a to the power of 6 divided by a to the power of 3 plus 1 divided by a to the power of 3. To the top, we have 1. So this is equal to 1. We divide it by, if you divide this, you are going to obtain a to the power of 3. So we have a to the power of 3 plus 1 divided by a to the power of 3 is the same thing as 1 divided by a all to the power of 3. The bottom is just sum of two cubes. Remember, if you have sum of two cubes, let me do it here. Suppose we have x cubed plus y cubed. Remember that this is the same thing as you take the first term without power, x. You add it to the second term without power, y. Then you multiply by first term squared, that is x squared. Then plus the second term also squared. Then you subtract x multiplied by y without power, x, y. So we are going to apply the same thing to evaluate our denominator here. So this is equal to 1 divided by, we have a plus 1 divided by a. Then we multiply by a squared plus 1 divided by a squared then we minus a times 1 divided by a is equal to 1. Remember that a plus 1 divided by a is equal to 3 from here. Look at it here. a plus 1 divided by a is equal to 3. So we have 1 divided by 3 multiplied by a squared plus 1 divided by a squared is equal to 7. Remember that. Cut it here, we have 7. So we have 7 here, then minus 1. 7 minus 1 is 6, and 6 times 3 is equal to 18. 
Therefore, this is equal to 1 divided by 18 as our final answer, which implies that a to the power of 3 divided by a to the power of 6 plus 1 is equal to 1 divided by 18, provided that a is a root of that quadratic equation given to us. Thank you for watching. Do share to your learning colleagues and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more exciting videos. Bye-bye.